Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, please go subscribe down below and turn on those bell notifications because I do make videos every week. Today I'm bringing you a brand new video and this is something different for me. I'm going to be showing you a few swimsuits that I bought on eBay and I'm going to be trying them on for you guys and showing you how they fit and my opinions on them. I originally bought five swimsuits but the fifth one didn't come in the mail so I'm going to have to skip over that one and kind of just move along with the video and um, I will be showing you what swimsuit I did buy originally that didn't come in the mail. I have the other four so I'm going to be showing you those. So jumping right into it, the first one that I bought was this pink one and um, I just want to let you guys know I bought everything in a size large um, but some of them aren't true to size. So the first one is this pink one right here. And it just comes with the bottoms. They're very, very small. Like I said, I bought everything in a size large to X large. This is large to X large. But it does not look like a freaking large at all. This is like teeny weeny, super tiny. I tried to buy everything under $5 or so. This one was $2.99. And it comes in other colors and it did come with free shipping so that was nice but i didn't like the way that it fit it would it wouldn't fit me the way that a swim swimsuit normally fits so i'd give this about a two out of two out of five um five being extremely like i love this swimsuit and one being I hated this swimsuit. So I would give this a 2 out of 5. Um, I like the top part. I feel like the top part is going to fit me better. And then the bottoms I can just kind of just throw away because they don't fit me at all. The next swimsuit is this gray one right here. And this one is like a little clasp one on the it has like a little clasp on the back that you just kind of put together. There's no tying of any sort and you can adjust the back as the little adjust parts. Um, this is how wide it is. It does come with um, pads inside. Um, but for some reason the pads are like way too far out so my boobs are right here and these come at my side which is kind of weird so I didn't like that aspect and and just to remind you guys I did buy this in a large as well um, the top did fit me rather well but I didn't like the pads and then these are the bottoms as well they're kind of like they're really really long for some reason like they have their crotch the crotch is very very low which I thought was kind of weird it's supposed to be high-waisted so I kind of get where um, the low crotch is coming from um, this one was six dollars and eight cents and for some reason it's 69 cents for shipping um, I don't remember paying six dollars for this swimsuit I tried to buy everything under five dollars the price may have changed or this might be another listing but I'm pretty sure that I bought it under five dollars then we have this white one this one didn't fit at all the bottoms fit a little bit like it went over my butt and went over my crotch and everything but it would not go over my chest it was kind of like a Borat moment if you guys have seen the Borat movie and the way he wears that speedo that's what it looked like on me so this is what this one looks like it's just a one piece and then it has a low back to it it also has the little pads in the inside the top part 
I didn't enjoy that. This was just a terrible, terrible swimsuit. It didn't fit me at all. And remember, this is a size large. I'm trying to fit into a size large being pregnant and it didn't fit me at all. So this one was $4.61. It did come with free shipping, um, but unfortunately I didn't like it at all and it was just a terrible, terrible swimsuit. The last thing that I have that came in the mail was supposed to be a swimsuit and it's called the women's sexy crystal bandage bikini set push-up padded swimwear swimsuit bathing and this was $4.99 and I got this in a size large but apparently they sent me a lingerie set which I thought was really really strange because I did I think I'm pretty sure I ordered a swimsuit so this is what this looks like. It doesn't look like a swimsuit at all. It's just kind of a tiny bralette. And whose boobs fit inside these tiny little cups? Like, excuse me, no one's titties are going to fit inside these tiny little things right here. And then it does come with the bottoms as well, but this is a thong. So I don't know why they sent me a thong when I... Like I said, everything's in a large, but I don't see myself fitting in these. And on top of that, I don't wear thongs to begin with, so this is kind of disturbing. And I just kind of wasted $5 for a bralette that's not going to even fit me. Those were the ones that did come in the mail, and then the last one that was supposed to come in the mail was supposed to be a monokini and it was really super cute like the one cute bikini that I was supposed to get in the mail um, didn't come and didn't arrive and I'm super disappointed I did get a refund for it so that's nice but I really wish that I would have gotten that swimsuit um, it had like orchids and like cherry blossoms all over it it was super super cute and that's one that's what this one looks like. It was just a really super cute monokini. And it was um, retailed at $2.49. But I'm pretty sure that I bought it for $4. $4 and like 50 some cents. Because I did get refunded. And they refunded me the entire purchase. Um, it was free shipping. So I only got the $4 and something cents. Um, but I really wish that that would have came eBay is kind of just very iffy, so if you buy something from eBay, um, it can come in the mail, it sometimes won't come in the mail, but you will get your refund for it, you just kind of have to contact the seller. eBay is kind of one of those things like Wish where it's not as it seems. So. If you buy something thinking that it's going to look like the picture and it comes in the mail and doesn't look like the picture, don't be surprised because it's from China and it's it might be really bad quality. Just like everything that I bought, I didn't enjoy the thing, the swimsuits that I bought. I wouldn't recommend buying swimsuits on eBay just because of my experience. But if you've bought stuff on eBay, like swimsuits or dresses, things like that, and you've had a really good experience, then that's awesome and cheers to you guys. But in my case, I've really had bad experience buying swimsuits and I don't think I'll ever buy a swimsuit from eBay ever again. I think I'm just going to stick to like Walmart or Forever 21. Those are the, the stores that I really, really trust. I feel like if you were to buy a swimsuit, you probably want to try on the swimsuit before you actually purchase it. So that's my opinion and I just, I wouldn't recommend buying anything from eBay, I mean swimsuit wise, just because the, the sizes are kind of skewed and if you order a size large and you are like a medium or a small. Um, it might not fit or it might fit so it's kind of like you, it's up in the air so you don't really know 
But that's all I have for you guys today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave me a like down below. Subscribe, it helps me out a ton. Let me know any of your guys' opinions, comments, concerns down in the comment section below. Um, let me know which swimsuit that you enjoyed. Um, and I will talk to you guys soon in the next video. Thank you guys for watching, guys. Bye.